Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at the Ruger LCP2 light rack chambered in 22 long rifle. Magazine to carry 10 rounds of 22. It's called the light rack because it has a very lightweight recoil spring that makes it easy to rack. But it shares many of the same characteristics, size, and pretty much the same weight as the LCP2 in 380, except for it carries 10 rounds of 22 long rifle. 2.75 inch barrel. It's unloaded weight, 11 ounces, 12 and a quarter ounces loaded with 11 rounds. This does have a push forward thumb safety. All right, it's engaged and you just push it forward to disengage it. Hammer fired, built in sights. So it's a nice little handgun in 22. So we're gonna check it out. Take a few shots here. And it's a 22, so it does have some reliability issues with the 22. But one of the things I like this opposed to the 380 model is that it does have a base plate there that is still only two finger contact all right but it just gives a little more of grip space to to grab onto but it's a it's a cool little gun and for those who want a training tool for uh younger kids who are getting into the shooting sport something like this would be a nice and easy way for them to get involved let me go ahead and try that again i've got different types of ammo um, I do believe this is federal uh, target loads. Uh, what I just shot was CCI. Like most 22s, it takes a little bit of discovery to figure out what exactly is going to be your best choice. And it's an accurate little thing, I tell you. I I'm uh, pretty impressed with this. Now, one of the things that I like outside of the weight and everything is that Ruger gives you a pocket holster, which is a nice touch. But the MSRP is 349, and so you're looking at closer to 300 in today's market now. The LCP2 and 380 dropped quite a bit, and I expect this to do the same, but it's still a new gun, and that really has not happened, uh, at least so far. So you're still looking at right around $300 for this model, but it's small, it's lightweight, it's a nice little backup gun with that pocket holster, Keep that keeps that trigger guarded against uh, any discharge. It does have front serrations right there. It also has the magazine disconnect. All right, so without that mag in there, nothing's happening. It does have a trigger bar safety, and I already mentioned a five and a half pound trigger that is pretty nice. I'm 10 yards away here, and I can see that, and that was all I had in that mag. I don't know, five or six rounds. Let me load it up. We'll turn the camera around. You can get a, a front view of it. And you can check out the light rack LCP2. Another feature that this gun has, right on the back of the slide, they have what's called cocking ears. It comes out just a little bit to give you a little more to hold on to. It does have a metal guide rod. Very light, lightweight recoil spring but a cool little pistol here let me go ahead and take a few shots and you can check it out and expect zero recoil and that's it ruger lcp2 light rack and 22 long rifle with the pocket holster nice little pistol 
one of the things I was going to do that I never did was just put a little bit of white or orange paint on that front sight because you may have noticed a couple times I, I had to align because the background is not very bright and that little bit of orange orange would be pretty cool to put right on that front sight just to give you a little clear picture because it is a, a integrated built-in sight system that is black serrated so that that's the only thing it does have a glass filled nylon frame that's consistent with Ruger's but a cool little gun and I'm happy to feature the LCP2 light rack if you like videos like this please subscribe and share I always appreciate the thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys peace